Durango, Mexico, Reuters, investigators sifting through the wreckage of an Aeromexico passenger jet on Wednesday located the Plania Euro trademark S flight recorders, which may hold clues about what caused it to crash as it took off during stormy weather in northern Mexico. The Mexico City-bound Embraer 190 passenger jet smashed into scrubland near the runway shortly after the plane took off from an airport in northern Durango State on Tuesday. All 103 passengers and crew survived by evacuating the plane before it caught fire. Nearly everyone on the flight suffered minor injuries, Mexican officials said. Luis Gerardo Fonseca, director of Mexico Euro Trademark S Civil Aviation Agency, told local news media on Wednesday that the recorders had been found. A Euro we already have them a Euro he said in an interview with broadcaster Televisa. Commercial aircraft carry a cockpit voice recorder and a flight data recorder, commonly known as a Euro or a black boxes a Euro which can contain crucial details of the last minutes of a flight before an accident. Video purportedly of the crash recorded from a plane window showed a dark sky and fog and the ground still visible moments before a thud and shrieking passengers were heard. Reuters could not independently verify the video. A Euro or Earth impact was very strong. We wanted to think it was a lightning strike a Euro said Chicago resident and passenger Lorenzo Nunez. A Euro or it was terrible, absolutely terrible a Euro Nunez said he had been visiting family in Durango. A time-lapse video posted by webcams of Mexico, filmed during the hour before the crash, showed dark clouds and fog or rain moving in. Officials said it was too early to say what caused the crash of flight number 2431. Aeromexico said in a Wednesday morning Twitter post that 64 people had been released from hospitals. Two people were more seriously injured, including the pilot and a minor, the state health department said. Fonseca told broadcaster ADN40 that his team began working at the crash site around 7 a.m. local time, 12 o'clock GMT, along with representatives of the U.S. National Transportation Safety Board, NTSB, and U.S. Federal Aviation Administration, FAA. Representatives of Embraer SA and the maker of the Plania Euro trademark S engines, General Electric CEO, were also assisting, Fonseca said. It can take safety investigators months to piece together the complex chain of events leading to an accident. Determining the cause of the Durango crash may be made easier by the location of the crash, which should allow easy access to evidence, such as the retrieved flight recorders, as well as interviews with the crew and other survivors. Under international rules, Mexico will lead the investigation with support from Brazil, where the Embraer jet was designed and built, and from the United States, where General Electric CO made the CF-3410E engines. Aeromexico leased the 10-year-old aircraft involved in Tuesday a Euro trademark S incident from Republic Airlines in the United States in 2014, according to data on Planespotters.net. A spokesman for Republic Airlines said on Wednesday that the company briefly leased the plane to Aeromexico, but the aircraft was sold to a third party in 2015. The airline did not give the name of the third party.